Hi, I'm Kent McGuire with OSU Ag Safety and Health. Spring is one of the busiest seasons for farm equipment on local roadways. During this time, it's necessary for regular motorists and farm equipment to share the road and each want to reach their destination in a safe manner. Let's take a minute to discuss roadway safety with agricultural equipment. As an equipment operator, first make sure that all warning flashers and lights are in proper operating condition and ensure slow moving vehicle emblems are clean and easily visible. Use turn signals or proper hand signals to give plenty of warning to other motorists your intention to turn. Plan ahead and watch for roadside obstacles. Keep an eye out on cars behind you. Often vehicles will rapidly approach from the rear at two to three times the speed of your tractor. In some cases, it may be helpful to pull over and allow cars to pass when it's safe. If possible, move equipment at off-peak hours and use an escort vehicle if needed. And always have your brake pedals locked together, rollover protective structure in place, and your seat belt fastened. As a motorist sharing the road with agricultural equipment, understand that most ag equipment today will not fit in one lane of the road. Equipment operators do their best to hug the edge of the road. However, they also have to navigate around roadside obstacles like steep ditches, mailboxes, roadsides, and bridge railings. Consider that operators of farm equipment may have limited vision to what is behind them, simply because of the size of the equipment that they're towing and take into account most farm equipment is traveling at 25 miles an hour or less. As a motorist at 55 miles an hour, your reaction time to closing distance is greatly reduced in order to prevent a rear end collision. For more information, visit our website at agsafety.osu.edu. Have a safe day and we'll see you next time.